Tonight, a crime task force is launching a new project to help ensure safety and bring the community together in Spartanburg. 7 News' Alessandra Young breaks down how you can help. Officials with the Spartanburg Police Department tell me that in order to help solve crimes, they need people to come forward with information. They say working together is the key to making the city as safe as possible. Authorities with the Spartanburg Police Department say the city has seen an overall decrease in violent crime over the past 20 years. But in July, Major Art Littlejohn says things took a bit of a turn. This year, we did have an increase in our homicides in July. He says having the community to help solve crimes makes the process of serving justice much faster. That's sometimes where we struggle, where we're not able to get the information that we need because people are not willing to give us that information. United to Prevent Crime was created in August to help reduce crime, as well as helping community members feel a sense of trust when reporting crimes. If we can build that with our public safety, with our uh, first responders, we, I think we can help stop a lot of the crime. The organization has three subgroups, trust, community, and gangs. Michelle Gray is a trust advocate. She says they want to help prevent crimes before they happen, and a lot of that comes down to helping the youth who live in the city. If we don't help them see beyond the walls that they look into every day, if we don't get to see them look past that window that they see, we won't have a community to build. Gray says they're launching a new project called Love, Not Fear to help. If you love and have that trust in where you live, you won't be fearful to be able to, you know, put on the forefront who or what may be going on in your neighborhood that could actually help. She says the organization works with law enforcement and the Department of Juvenile Justice. Gray tells me they're helping to build back a village where there's trust, everyone has a voice, and solutions are made. Some of the things the group has accomplished is holding events for the community, working with schools to have chaperones present at events, and holding monthly meetings to discuss where change is needed. Little John says groups like these are essential in getting the community's trust. Many times uh, with crimes, uh, when, we, when the crime happened, we're not there. And so we have to have people on our side that encourage the community to give us information. If you have solutions or ideas, the United to Prevent Crime Group has its next meeting on January 21st at the TK Gregg Community Center in Spartanburg. Alessandra Young, 7 News. If you have information that will help solve a crime, head to WSPA.com for the links to give anonymous tips.